Now, I had some difficulties with recording, and yeah, this is actually a major issue for me. I'm just gonna build this little building on the side of this flat ride real quick, but I want, there's something serious that I do want to talk about, because during the recording of this episode, my game crashed three times, and I had to restore what I had previously, and then keep on recording, so that's... You might have picked up that there were some differences or that I did some things twice probably because I couldn't exactly remember what I did and what I lost. But yeah, that's due to my computer uh, crushing. I have, I don't exactly know what this what this issue is, but I figure that it has something to do with my computer overheating though. Uh, my, lap my laptop, because I'm on the laptop and it's really crappy to be honest. But I put it on a cooling pad, even added some like external cooling shit, and uh, played the game for like 
one minute and then it crashed. It just says Roller Coast Tycoon 3.x stopped working. And I'm like, holy shit, I had a major freak out. I was so fucking mad and I'm still pissed off. And I've actually recorded two episodes in a row and in total the game crashed five times and I was very frustrating. So I feel like this is actually a major issue because it's in a way stopping me from actually playing this game. Try to stream No Scope the Ride 2 also crashed. So that's that a big problem. Now, the only thing that I can think of right now is I'm probably going to do a total reset. Either that, or I'm going to remove all of my custom scenery, except for the custom scenery that I used in this park, and just try if the game runs better if I delete a lot of the custom scenery. Because I've already deleted some stuff, but I still have hundreds of set, and possibly my laptop can't take all of that stuff. But I feel like there's no other way, so it's either that or a total computer reset. And in any way, I'm still saving to get a good computer. But yeah, I, I've only got 200 euros in my bank account. I've got, um, I've, uh, yeah, basically I've saved up all of the other money to get a driver's license and then put that away on, uh, on like a different bank account. So now I've only got 200 euros left and some, yeah, some cash is like. But the only problem is that. I don't even have a fucking job, so I'm. In it. I have a real problem here. That's basically that. So if if you see me not doing too many episodes of this let's play, then at least you know why. I am um, planning though to get this la this new computer as soon as I can, and then keep on recording. And as soon as I have that new computer, I'm probably going to lose my shit to Rollerco Second Three. I'm probably going to play it 24/7. I already play it like. 18.7, but then, then it's going to be like 24.7, so that's going to be cool. But in any way, this, this building is actually kind of boring in a way. I just wanted to add a small building next to the flat ride. By the way, I'll just talk about it because some people want time lapses, some people want me to talk. Well, now I'm going to talk. And uh, yeah, this is just a simple building that I wanted to have next to the flat ride just to get that more steampunky feel. And if you've noticed that I suddenly started adding pipes then that's uh, thanks to Flux Trans because uh, he was building his park with a shitload of pipes uh, or should I say ass load or shit ton whatever uh, loads of pipes and I, um, I was like oh, maybe I could do that in my park as well and he was like yes so I, I'm doing that now I've also I've also started ag adding gears because I thought I didn't have gear like uh, Votheen's gizmos so I went to Flux Trans stream and I was like hmm I don't think I have that set then I, I downloaded it and installed it and then it said that I already had it. So I was like, okay, might as well. So now I'm adding gears and cogs because I figured, yeah, that's something really essential in that steampunk theme. So the rest of the buildings, especially of the um, inverted coaster, but I'm also going to add some buildings to, that, to the free fly coaster, are going to be a lot more like this, more pipes and industrial stuff. Um, but of course, the, the base is still going to be... Um, with uh, the, the castle walls from Station Gym and of course the Alpine set because this is still this is still Alpine steampunk medieval theme with whatever this is everything theme but so far it hasn't it, it's actually worked out quite well surprisingly at least to me it doesn't look that bad so yeah I'm glad about that especially this flat right though this building is looking pretty cool so that's going all well now I'm just figuring out what kind of roof I should use. I mean, there aren't any good corner pieces for 4H roofs, I think, in Shigo's Alpine Village, so I'm just going to use this one. And then I'll probably add some more pipes to this little building. It's going to be like, whatever, uh, some sort of generator building, something random next to it. I'll probably also do some rock work, because the ground here is looking quite boring right now and I don't know exactly what I'm going to do in the space between this building and the castle that the free fly coaster runs around where you can see the uh, the grassy hillside but yeah I'll probably come up with something maybe I can just do uh, some rock work maybe add a waterfall maybe add some pipes I don't know I, I, I guess I'll see as long as this game doesn't crash of course so I'm just gonna add some rock work and then uh, this, uh, I think this uh, episode's gonna be finished. So um, see you all in the next episode and thanks for watching. Bye guys.